Uh, so cataracts are uh, one of the most common surgeries that get done in people who are above the age of 65. A cataract is essentially a clouding of the natural lens inside the eye. So the lens, the natural lens lives behind the iris or the colored part of the eye. Um, and uh, the lens looks pretty clear when we are younger. When this lens, instead of looking clear, starts becoming cloudy, then that blocks the light that goes into the back of the eye. So in a manner of speaking, it's like looking through a dirty window. The person who has the cataract starts getting a, a decline of their vision. And this can manifest in, in very many ways. So for some people, it might be difficulty with driving. Um, other folks find it more difficult to read. They feel like they need more light to be able to read. The ophthalmologist diagnoses the cataract by doing a complete eye exam. So what we do is we dilate up the pupil and then actually have a direct look at the cataract to be able to assess uh, how far along a cataract is and how much it could be affecting the patient's vision. The timing of the cataract surgery is very individual. So this is where I will tell all my patients, I can tell you you've got a cataract, but you have to help me decide what we need to do for you. And some people want the cataract surgery done tomorrow, whereas others would like to wait six months, a year, perhaps even longer. So that's always the patient's decision as to when they want to go ahead with the surgery. Cataract surgery is one of the most successful surgeries out of every 100 cataract surgeries that get done, 95 or 96 percent are going to do just fine, no problems at all. The recovery from the, from the current surgery is very quick and usually within about a month, I'm able to go ahead and give the patient their new prescription for eyeglasses. I have countless patients who will come in and say to me, Doc, you've changed my life. Uh, I was having so much difficulty driving or reading or watching television, uh, you've given me a new lease on my life, uh, which is just so gratifying.